Slim 1200 GGI Mob shit, and I'm back. <clears throat> and tonight, you know what I'm saying, we're going to be talking about Tank, you know what I'm saying, out the 7-1. Well, they say he was really out to know you, but you know what I'm saying, he started banging in the 7-1 and started claiming the 7-1, well, so long live Tank, you know what I'm saying. But, um, yeah, man, one of my brothers was locked up with him, one of my little brothers, he said, dude, definitely was about his business, you know what I'm saying. But he said, you know, he had a lot of little run-ins in jail, you know what I'm saying? And he said, dude, he used to always be saying, you know what I'm saying? He ain't going back to jail, you feel me? Whenever them people ran down on him or whatever, he was going to bang it out. He sure wasn't stunned, you know what I'm saying? He really went down, you know what I'm saying? But like I said, long live Tank, you know what I'm saying? But I'm going to read this to y'all off um, Channel 4 WWL Eyewitness News um, website. So it says, Corner suspect killed himself with fatal shot during gun battle with police. So it said, the death of a man during an officer involved shooting Sunday was the result of a suicide, according to the Orleans Parish Coroner's Office. Bernie Porch, 37, died Sunday after an incident with the state police. Officers were on patrol looking for a stolen vehicle and tried to make a traffic stop on a vehicle they believed was stolen. As police were stopping that vehicle, one subject got out and began firing, hitting a trooper in the left elbow. During a, during a hunt for the suspects, police came across one of the suspects later identified as Porsche and exchanged gunfire near Lauren and New Orleans streets. According to a statement from Dr. Jerry Rouse, Porsche can be seen on the dash cam video from the New Orleans Pol Police Department firing at police while running across the street. After a brief period of being motionless, Mr. Porsche then moves his right arm, moves his arm, and another shot occurs in close proximity to his head. While officers remain at, the, at a distance, said the corner, Porsche suffered three, shot, three gunshot wounds, said the statement from Rouse. The first wound in his legs and the second wound hit him in, in, the, in the lung. Both bullets were collected and neither of these wounds transverse major blood vessels and both were potentially survivable, said Ross. The fatal gunshot was the third one. This wound had an entrance on the right side of the head and exit on the left, leaving no fragments observable on x-ray nor recoverable for analysts. Significant, significantly, the entrance will show evidence of soot the, the disposition on the skin with searing around the edges and soot on the underlying bone. This pattern, of course, this pattern occurs when the bullet is fired with a muzzle contact in a muzzle contact the skin. Due to the video and autopsy evidence, Porsche that is consistent with a self-inflicted gunshot. Down the state police. And the, and, the, and the force investigating team of New Orleans Police Department were present according to the coroner. So damn, it was deep for that boy's shit. But Chad and my brother said that boy used to stay saying, man, I ain't going back to jail, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'ma bang it out with them bitches. And you know what I'm saying? Whatever, 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 you feel me? But on the video they got, you would clearly see, you know what I'm saying? He came running from somewhere. I don't know if you know, they had a car that they was chasing at first, but it looked like he had already jumped out the car, you know what I'm saying? And just he, because it's like he just ran into the camera. Like once he ran into the camera, you could see him shooting, boom, 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 and the police shooting back. He fell, but then you could clearly see that boy hit himself, boom, because he jumped. Like when he hit, once he hit himself in the head, you could see his body jump. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, damn, like that nigga, man, he wasn't going back to jail. You know what I'm saying? They say it was an in and out. You know what I'm saying? Once he hit himself, the bullet went in one side and came out the other side. So. That must have been a bullet that skipped the ground. You can see when he when he shot pop, it looked like a little a little fire jumped on the ground. You know what I'm saying? Long live tank though, man. Shit, that was wild. Like nigga said, man, dude, man, he wasn't going back for nothing. You know what I'm saying? 
he he really he really banged it out with them bitches for real. Man, that shit crazy. Now, when an officer involved shooting in the seventh war, the Orleans Parish Coroner ruled the man's death is a suicide. 37 year old Bernie Porsche died Sunday, and police say he shot at officers near the intersection of New Orleans and Law. An officer shot back, they say, hitting Porsche once in the leg and once in the upper back. The coroner says a third wound to the side of his head was the fatal gunshot inflicted by Porsche. A state trooper was injured in that encounter, and two other men are still on the loose for their part in the incident. Here's a look at the video taken from the dash cam of an NOPD cruiser on August 21st. You see 37 year old Bernie Porsche emerge from the right of your screen, raise his arm and open fire on three police officers walking down Law Street. Two officers exchange gunfire with Porsche who gets shot twice and falls to the ground. Moments later, the police video shows him taking his own life. We're not showing you that portion of the video, but police say Porsche used this handgun to fire at them and the ballistics show it's the same gun he used to shoot himself. As we have done in every police involved shooting since I've been the chief, within the first days of the incident, we brought the family of Mr. Porsche into the Public Integrity Bureau and they had an opportunity to view this video and I personally met with them about the circumstances of this incident and they were grateful for that, for that opportunity. The NOPD says Porsche opened fire on Louisiana State Troopers prior to getting into the gun battle with the NOPD and then taking his own life. Porsche shot one trooper in the arm. His injury is not life-threatening. LSP followed Porsche and two other unidentified men who they say were in a stolen vehicle. Police are still looking for those men, but inside that car was this assault rifle. And they are willing to do whatever it takes to keep from going to jail. Their actions gave our officers no choice but to respond with deadly force. Long live Tank, you know what I'm saying? And may the peace, mercy, and blessings of our Lord be up on his soul. And may the peace, mercy, and may the peace, mercy, and blessings of our Lord be with his family. You know what I'm saying, kids or whoever. You know what I'm saying. I'll be right back, man. Y'all stay plugged. Hit that like button. Make sure that notification bell turned on. Get in that comment section. You know what I'm saying. Hit that subscribe button and tell a friend to hit that subscribe button. I'll be right back. Slum 1200. I just hit my shooter, told him knock his head off. Leave him on the block. Yeah, it's fuck the ops. Riding with the mop. With the mock up in my pot. 30 in the Glock. That's about a hundred shots. I get it out the mud. Or I get it in blood. Yeah, I'm the plug. I'm show love like bug. Trying to get my family and my niggas out the hood. Pedal to the metal roller. Op up in the wood. Gang, gang shit. I be on it like I'm sure. Smoking on that Manny Pacquiao. That be that good.